Okay, now let's move on to solve the finding the trigger ratio of obtuse angle. Okay, so example one, example one, what do they want us to do is to uh, using the acute angle to find the three significant figure answer of their trigger ratio. So what we have learned just now is sine 180 degree minus theta is equal to sine theta, and also cosine 180 degree minus theta is equal to negative cosine theta so for part A from sine 135 I have to change them to <coughs> acute angle so it will be equal to sine 180 minus 135 is actually 180 minus 45 degree so based on this formula Now my theta is actually 45, so it can be written as equals sine 45 degree. So we pass a greater <coughs> sine 45, and I will get how do I change 0 0.707, 0 0.707, three significant figure. Okay, this is how we use. Uh, convert obtuse angle into an acute angle so if I look at part B cosine once okay, so cosine 168 degree okay same thing use the formula so first we have to change to a 180 degree form first remember always change to 180 degree minus another angle so 168 is 180 degree minus 12 degree Correct? Yeah, correct. So based on the formula, cosine 180 degree minus theta will be equal to negative cosine theta. Alright. So again, use the calculator. Cosine 12 degree is 0 0.978. 0 0.978. Add a negative sign same thing three significant figure all right <coughs> actually we can double check this actually uh, in, in exam if you see this kind of question you don't really have to work out this way unless you are told to do so otherwise what you can do is just press let's say cosine 168 168 and you get negative 0 0.978 which is exactly the same as what you have here Alright, 